Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I have got everybody's favorite. I have a $10 dupe. Uh, the Hush app released another dupe and unfortunately for this one I can't compare it for you but I can give you some swatches, a tutorial, and how I think it performed overall. So what we have here is going to be the Inferno. This is the carton that it comes in and uh, it, the palette looks like this and when you flip it open this is how it looks it's got a mirror it's got all these nice colors so just to address the elephant in the room yes when hush advertised this it did look a lot more red than it turned out but overall it is still you know a very solid product and for ten dollars things are going to be a little off so the first thing i want to do for you is just give you some swatches um i'm going to do the first row and then the second row and we're just going to see how those look and then we'll jump straight into a tutorial okay guys so here is going to be your first row um in order we've got white hot baked, lit, blaze, warmth, and smolder. Uh, these are some of the colors that I use to create this look. Um, they are very pretty. The mattes have to be built a little bit, but the shimmers are amazing. They are a little chunkier than usual, but still gorgeous. Okay, so let me get those second row swatches for you real quick. Okay guys, so for the second row, let me get this in focus, we have got Glow, Flames, which is what's all over my lid, Bonfire, Burn, Hot Spot, and Ignite. Ignite, I'm so curious about. It is a very unique shimmer to what I'm used to. I'll show it to you in the pan up close because it's just very very interesting let me turn my brightness back up and I'll be right back you guys okay so those are the swatches for this palette I wanted to be sure you got to see all of them uh, just to see that they are definitely beautiful I personally have never used the Naked Heat or the Toasted Tartlet which are the two that I personally feel like this palette resembles but I do think that this look is definitely one of my favorites. Um, I really love these colors. All these warm, toasty colors just make my heart so happy. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and let y'all see this tutorial. And uh, if you are not, I almost forgot, if you are not subscribed to my channel, hit that button. Subscribe. I post three times a week, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday, unless something happens. And uh, hit that notification bell so you can see when I post it's usually early in the morning but lately my computer has been rude so it's been a little bit later but let's get straight into the tutorial and I hope you all have a great day see y'all in a second okay so First, we're going to take this big fluffy brush and we're just going to dip into baked right there. And we're just going to put this all over the lid. Okay guys, so the next thing we're going to do is take our white bristle brush and we're going to dip into warmth. That's right here. Okay, and before I go to my next color, I just want to bring up that, like with all the other Bad Habit palettes, there is a teeny bit of kickback. But that's nothing crazy, so nothing to be too concerned about in my opinion. Okay, so next I want to go into Burn, 
right here. And I'm going to put that in my crease just a little bit lower down. Okay. So the next thing that I want to do is dip into Smolder right here. This is the darkest color in the palette. <clears throat> And I'm just going to focus that on the outside of the crease and try to go with a really light hand so that I don't overdo it. Okay, so that is it for the crease. Um, now, like always, we're just going to pick up a metallic and see how this lays on the lid. I'm not feeling too, too dark today. And since I've got some red tones in here, I think I want to pick up flames because this color is kind of speaking to me for whatever reason. Right here. I'm just going to pick it up on my finger and just rub it on the lid. And this seems to be a little bit chunkier than the usual consistency of the shimmers in these Bad Habit palettes. We're just going to pack some on and see what we can do. Okay, so after some serious packing, that color is actually looking really nice. Um, that's going to be it for the lid, so I'm going to hop off here, like I always do, go finish the rest of my makeup, and I will be right back for the lower lash line and the final, final opinion, I guess. See y'all in just a second. Okay, so now that everything else is done, we are just going to jump right back in and get this lower lash line taken care of and ignore my hair. It doesn't know how to act today. So the first thing we're just going to go into warmth, then burn, and then smolder in that order and just put them down here. Okay, that should take care of our lower lash line. Now we just need to get this inner corner and uh, toss a little bit up on that brow bone. So for the inner corner, I want to take Blaze. It's very similar to what we used. Ooh, we used Flames, not the other one. It's very similar, but just a little bit lighter. I'm just going to take that on my finger and put it right here. And then for our brow bone, I'm not going to put a shimmer. Well, this is kind of a satin. I'm going to take White Hot. It's got a satin finish, and I'm just going to put that up in my brow bone. Okay. So that's going to be it for this look um, as far as this palette. I think it blended very nicely. I think it is good quality and for $10, I mean, you just can't really beat Bad Habit and you can't beat honestly anything off of the Hush app. It is all just super incredible to me. So I hope y'all enjoyed this quick tutorial and review and uh, I'll catch y'all on Tuesday. See y'all later. Bye guys.